your fertilization report. So it looks like out of the 42 eggs retrieved, 26 were mature and 21 fertilized. Do you know how many were ICSID and how many like did it naturally? Yes, so it looks like they did um, 31 with ICSI and 11 naturally. Do you know of the 11 uh, that were natural, how, how many of those fertilized? Um, I think they're mostly from the ICSI though, but they said they did about 20 or 25% with the natural um, and about 75% with the ICSI. Okay. All right. So yeah. It's, probably, it's a good thing we did the ICSI. Yeah, because that's what we—that's what I was wondering. Because we were wondering if we were having a fertilization issue. Um, so yeah. I was just wondering how many of the natural ones actually were able to do it. So at this point, usually we'll give the eggs a couple more days um, to grow, and then we'll give you a call on Wednesday with your day three embryo report. Okay, and then if you don't mind, just asking the lab if they know um, how many of the natural ones actually did. On yeah, their own, I'm just moment. curious. Put you on a brief hold. Okay. We will then check with the lab, and they said seven um, of them were the regular information. Oh, okay. All right. Well, that's, that's not too bad good. then. Yeah, that's not bad. So maybe that's not yeah. our issue. Okay, cool. All right. So, we'll give them a few more days to grow and then we'll give you a call Wednesday, okay? Hey, what you doing? The doctor office just called me. Uh-huh. So, we had the 42 retrieved and then yep. only 26 were mature. Okay, cool. And 21, we uh -huh, and 21 fertilized. Wow, awesome, okay. That's fantastic. At least we're starting off with 21. I had a feeling a lot of them were gonna be immature though because when we were doing all of our follicle scans, there was only like 20 six or something that we're measuring the appropriate size, you know. Right. I mean, geez, he was pretty much spot on with that, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. He said about, you know, 20 to 25 he was thinking would be mature. Gotcha. We got 26 of them. And 26 okay. and 21 fertilized, so. Wow, that's awesome. So I guess out of the mature ones, we had a good fertilization rate. We lost five of them, five mature ones. Well, heck, I'll, I'll take that. Yeah, so next time we'll hear from them is Wednesday, and they'll let us know how many have survived to that point. Good. I was just calling to tell you that. Yeah, well, thank you, sweetheart. I was wondering about that, so that makes me super happy. So after I got the phone call for the fertilization report, I literally have been on the couch and asleep, like, all day. I'm definitely really super tired from everything. I'm still having a lot of cramps today. As long as I'm like laying still with my heating pad, I'm uncomfortable, but I'm okay. But when I'm up and about, especially sitting kind of how I am right now, there's a lot of pressure. But we are pretty excited that we are starting off with 21 fertilized eggs. So right now we have 21 little babies growing in a petri dish at our doctor's office. So that's pretty cool to think about. The numbers will definitely drop off in the coming days, but as of now, as long as everything goes well, hopefully that will leave us with a decent amount of embryos at the end of all of this. I'm just gonna continue to rest up. I've been drinking my Propel and eating salty food. So hopefully that's helping combat the bloating and the OHSS. The rest of tonight, I am going to be relaxing, watching some TV, waiting for Derek to get home from work. And I have the day off tomorrow as well to recover a little bit more. So I will pop back in after our next embryo update.